ODM leader Ayla Erdinger yesterday broke his silence on the fake gold scandal admitting that he met the United Arab Emirates ruler Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum. Claiming he was the scam's whistleblower, Rayla defended Interior Cabinet Secretary Fred Mashangai against accusations of involvement. Rayla said Mashangai has no links whatsoever with the scam. In matters of this gold involving the Arabs, Dubai buyers, Mashangai is as clean, white as cotton, Rayla said. Bungoma Senator Moses Witangula had dropped the Ojai representative for infrastructure's name in a leaked phone call with the Dubai-based buyer identified as Ali Zandi. The lawmaker also claimed President Uro Kenyatta was aware of plans to secure release of the consignment. Witangula, in the recording, is heard assuring Zandi, said to be a business associate of Al Maktoum, that he had talked to Rayla who in turn reached out to Uru to secure release of the containers. In a new twist to the matter under investigation by the police, Rayla said he was the one who warned Sheikh Al Maktoum that they were being duped. The ODM leader said he quickly discovered the person who posed as Mashangai in a phone call with the Dubai buyer was a fake. I asked the Arab, Zandi, to put the purported Mashangai on the phone and spoke to a person who said he was ready to ship the consignment to Wajir, the ODM leader said. Rayla said the caller promised the Dubai buyer that he would store the detained gold until the buyer accepts to pay the SH 200 million bribe to secure its release. They claimed to be ready to transfer the consignment to Wajir where the buyer was to collect it, he added. These people are crooks they are known. Investigations must be heightened to arrest those involved.